the children typically experience a great many risk factors and this includes poverty drug and alcohol problems in the family and community violence and multiple changes in caregivers the lives of the children are greatly disrupted when mothers are arrested and most children show emotional and behavioral problems the impact this has depends on the age of the child the alternate caregiving arrangements and of course the mother's incarceration children of incarcerated mothers experience internalizing fear withdrawal depression emotional disturbance and they externalize anger fighting stealing substance abuse and a heightened rate of school failure and eventual criminal activity and incarceration children whose mothers are in prison or jail are amongst the riskiest of the high risk children in our nation and society these children typically experience poverty school problems repeated shifting of households and caregivers and the pain and disruption that accompany separation from the mother families are more likely to be disrupted by women's incarceration than the men's and why children experience the incarceration of a father more frequently than the incarceration of a mother due to the larger male population of inmates the children of incarcerated mothers are more likely to be displaced from their homes and experience problems associated with the separation from their parents and children of female inmates suffer even more trauma since the mothers usually are the primary caregiver and despite the degree of trauma these children experience and the amount of trouble that later cost society children of incarcerated mothers are an oddly ignored group and they are in every town every city and every rural community yet no agency counts them or provides service in an organized way for them Thank you.